friends, welcome to Classic Masala Hut. Today we are going to make mutton ghee roast. So for making this mutton ghee roast, I have taken 1 kg of mutton and I have cut them into medium sized pieces. Now I am going to cook the mutton separately in a pressure cooker. So before adding the mutton, let's add some ghee. 3 tablespoons of ghee. I am going to add a tablespoon of ginger garlic paste and half teaspoon of turmeric powder and give it a stir and then add the mutton pieces add some salt and I am going to cook this for 3 to 4 minutes in the ghee now to this add some water not too much just to cover the pieces after adding the water cover add the weight and cook this for 4 to 5 whistles on a medium heat or until the meat is soft and tender. While the mutton is cooking, let's make a special masala for our mutton ghee roast. For that, in a pan, I'm going to roast the cashmere chilies first. They add a very nice red color to the recipe and at the same time they are less spicy. After roasting, let's transfer this to a plate. I'm going to roast the spices, 1 tablespoon of coriander seeds. 1 tablespoon of peppercorns, 1 teaspoon of fennel seeds, 2 teaspoons of cumin seeds and the whole spices, 1 cinnamon stick, 4 cloves, 1 star anise and 6 regular red chillies. After adding all the spices, roast it for few minutes until you feel the nice aroma of the roasted spices. Now you can see the seeds are nicely roasted. Let's turn off the heat and I am going to transfer everything into a blender. Then the roasted spices, a piece of ginger, two cloves of garlic, along with this add a tablespoon of lemon juice, some water and grind it to a very smooth paste. Now let's check our mutton. See the pieces are nice and tender. Now I am going to transfer the broth in a bowl. The reason why we are separating is, if we add the mutton pieces along with broth, then we will end up in mutton gravy and at the same time, we don't want to waste this broth. So we are going to add this broth to the masala and reduce it and then we are going to add the mutton and roast. Now the masala, mutton stock and mutton is ready. Now to make mutton ghee roast, I have taken quarter cup of ghee that is clarified butter. Now let's melt the ghee. Once the ghee is melted, add the masala paste and also add 2 tablespoons of thick yogurt. Mix this well with the ghee. Now I am going to add the broth. This has all the flavor and mix it well. Add some salt if required. We need to cook this until the gravy thickens and reduces. Now you can see the gravy is nice and thick. The ghee which we have added has oozed out. Now it's time to add the cooked mutton pieces. Mix it well with the masala mixture. After mixing nicely, cook this for 4 to 5 minutes on a medium heat. This smells great in here. Finally, add some curry leaves for garnishing. Give it a gentle mix and turn off the heat. Wow, delicious. Ta-da! Our delicious mutton ghee roast is ready. Look at the beautiful color. Uh, you can serve this for rice, chapatis, uh, puri and even dosas. Do try this recipe at home and if you like this video, please subscribe to our channel Classic Masala Hut. Spread the joy of cooking.